Jane from April, May, and the June Bugs. I would like to thank Jazz Bridge, Kim Tucker, our wonderful host, Suzette Ortiz, Watt, and everyone at Jazz Bridge, and Colleagues with Music for sponsoring. <laughs> April, May, and the June Bug's signature sound has evolved from the wellspring of American roots music. You could say serving up deep vintage vibes is our specialty. Musical influences are nourished by intoxicating vintage jazz swing, unbridled Americana and folk, effervescent rockabilly, and the spirited jump blues of the 30s and 40s. <laughs> perform on traditional and not so traditional homemade instruments, invoking elements of New Orleans early jazz and skiffle music. My name is April May. I'm from Morristown, New Jersey. I am the tap dancing washboard percussionist and kazooza phone scouting vocalist for April May and the June Bugs. <laughs> My inspirations come from the blessing of growing up in a musical family. Creatively inspired, I worked as an artist and a sculptor before devoting myself to music full time. My songwriting is inspired by deep vintage jazz and roots music, and I'm most excited by those magical moments in music that intersect genre and elicit joy. And I know. Gifted and talented musicians in our ensemble include, also from Morristown, New Jersey, multi-instrumentalist and vocalist, Catfish Dave Becca, deeply rooted in his guitar playing with a professional career spanning over 35 years. As multi-instrumentalist with April, May and the June Bugs, Catfish has co-fronted and entertained audiences across the Eastern Seaboard and the Deep South. He enjoys playing mandolin, banjo, traveling, and is principal bus driver of the Boogie Bus, our award-winning vegetable oil-powered tour bus. I chop wood all day long, kept this bed, keep this warm. Day to day, I try to make it as I pray. Cross and lay all long, when I stay too long, I will tell no more of my story. On drums and percussion from Vineland, New Jersey is Tony Mascara Jr. Born and raised into a musical family, Tony was given formal instruction early in life on piano, drums, and percussion. He studied jazz performance at Rowan University and has studied independently throughout his adult life. <laughs> began playing live at the age of 11 and has toured around the United States and abroad with several different groups spanning many different genres. He owns and operates his wonderful recording studio, The Audio Lab, for the past 25 years. 
Tony has also been a multi-instrumentalist on many records and has been playing with April May and the June Bugs for over a decade. We look forward to going into the studio with Tony over the summer and working on some new releases for this coming fall. From the suburbs of Philadelphia and Plymouth meeting on upright bass, Doug Drews. Playing bass for over 30 years, Doug studied bass with Madison Rast and Dennis Irwin, studied jazz performance at SUNY Purchase. He's toured with many rock, country, swing, and bluegrass bands, and he recently released a record with his trio, Bad at Words, titled 20 Years, currently writing for his next release. He performs about 150 shows a year, mostly here in the Philadelphia area. <laughs> Jazz Bridge neighborhood concerts are so important to our community because they help spread awareness about Jazz Bridge's mission. Jazz Bridge provides help and support to regional jazz and blues musicians who are in financial crisis. The concerts nourish community, they uplift and provide joy to people, which is so important and healing to the soul. I'm grateful to Jazz Bridge for this wonderful performance opportunity. It's indeed sacred space to be able to connect with an audience in a listening space, especially for jazz and blues artists. Thank you, Jazz Bridge. If you'd like to learn more about April May and the June Bugs, you can visit us online at aprilmay, spelled M-A-E, dot com. Thanks for watching.